cars mounting pavements and trucks undertaking just some of the dangerous manoeuvres putting our bin men and members of the public at risk. The waste disposal firm Biffa is so concerned it's put CCTV cameras on its trucks and helped police in Staffordshire prosecute more than 60 drivers. As Kevin Reid reports, almost every day the men and women on the bins are collecting evidence about dangerous drivers. These shocking CCTV images of bad and sometimes dangerous driving have been released by waste company Biffa in an attempt to highlight the risk refuse collectors are facing every day. This driver seems to think overtaking on grass verges is normal. And there are endless examples of cars, vans and lorries on pavements. Kyle Thomas has been involved in numerous incidents himself, one of which was caught on camera. Well, as I was uh, approaching the bin, I looked down the road and I seen there was uh, a vehicle oncoming quite fast. So I just had to take evasive action, really, put the bin back and I stepped onto the wall and then had to step back into the uh, residence garden and the vehicle just went past. I just think that they just got disregard, really. The company has become so concerned with the issue that it's now fitted all of its refuse lorries with CCTV cameras. And should there be an incident of dangerous driving, the driver here simply presses a red button and all of those recordings are passed on to the police. And while we were filming the inevitable, a van driver mounts the pavement to get past. Just hit the red button and that will go through to the uh, office. It's now become the norm for refuse collectors to see this kind of driving. The worst thing I've seen is a loader actually get hit by a vehicle uh, on the back of the wagon itself uh, as we was binning. He basically got too close to the loader and uh, struck him in the back of the legs and then tried driving off from a scene of an accident basically. And it's a, it's a daily thing. It's, we do it day in, day out. You, and you just get used to it, but you shouldn't have to get used to it. Staffordshire Police are the first force in the country to be using Biffa's evidence. There have been 60 people prosecuted. Um, they've actually gone through a Drive for Change programme, which seeks to change their driving standards, change their approach to driving, change their, their attitudes, um, so that we can avoid instances like this in the future. Biffa want to share their CCTV evidence with other police forces, and Warwickshire are expressing interest. Kevin Reid, BBC Midlands Today, Cannock in Staffordshire. The Royal Mail is having...